The hurricane season officially starts tomorrow, June 1st, but this year it's off to a running start. The official season spans June through November, which simply encompasses the majority of storms during an average year. It doesn't necessarily catch all of the hurricane activity. We say a running start because back in mid-January, there was the first hurricane of the season, Hurricane Alex, and just this past weekend, Tropical Storm Bonnie formed. Love New National Meteorological Service headquarters, where we sat down with Chief Meteorologist Dennis Gonguez, who gave us an insight on what we can expect this season. Um, tomorrow, um, Wednesday, first, Wednesday, June 1st, is the beginning of the 2016 hurricane season. And um, the, some institutions have produced um, outlooks, projections for the season, and some of them indicate that the season will be average above average um, and then the activity will be slightly above average average to slightly above average during the hurricane season. Um, in terms of the number of named systems, um, they are predicting somewhere between 12 and 16 named systems. The average from 1981 to 2010 is about 12. So they are predicting average to above average of number of named systems. And the uh, forecast for um, Hurricanes lies between four and eight, and the average is about six. So again, we're just about average to above average in that in that category. Last year, the hurricane season seemed a bit quiet, and there weren't any real threats. However, that was because the El Nino phenomena was around slowed down the development of hurricane activities. Ganges says this year there will be no El Nino. The predictions are for between one and four major hurricanes, that is category three, four, and five. The average for that is about two to three. So we, we're just about average to above average home activity in this hurricane season. Compared to last year, the conditions that were around that caused such a relatively quiet season, all that will change by the Ju end of July to, to end of uh, mid-August, all that will change. So we will not have the same conditions around that cause that quiet season, relatively quiet season last year. On Friday we had um, Bonnie, we had Bonnie and um, Bonnie farming out in by, by near to the um, United States, um, um, southeastern United southeastern United States. So we've had two early season um, storms so far with Alex earlier in January and then now Bonnie. Um, last week, so already the season is ramping up and um, we haven't started as yet. So we're looking at um, uh, uh, about a little bit above average se um, season this year. The, like I said, the El Nino phenomenon that was around, the warm Pacific Ocean that caused the quiet season over, over this side, that will decay. That will decay by, by, by August, so then um, we can look forward to a uh, rather um, active season above average um, activity. Gonges spoke about preparedness techniques that should have been in place for family and businesses months ago. So months ago we should have started preparing, um, stocking up on, on, on canned goods, um, knowing which shelter you, you, will, you, will, you will go to when, when the hurricane, when, when the weather threatens. Um, when will, when will, what time will you leave your home to head to the shelter? You don't want to be get caught between the, your home and the shelter in a, in a long line of traffic or something that you cannot reach the shelter in time. So all that you need to have within your, 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 your hurricane emergency plan. Well, what all will you take to the shelter? Not only canned goods, you have to take other, other, um, other necessities such as um, your, like your house paper, important papers, you know, you have to, medications, you have to plan all that, what, what you will take to the shelter, when you will leave, when, when, will, when will you leave home to head to the shelter so that you don't get caught out in the storm. So, um, it's preparedness is the most important thing. You have to be ready because we don't know which, when and where the system will make landfall. The hurricane season ends at the end of November and it begins in June 1st.